Hello everyone, the given question says that tabulate the differences in the characteristics of states of matter. So, B part is comment upon the following rigidity, compressibility, fluidity, filling a gas container, shape, kinetic energy and density. So, first of all, we are going to do A part in this question. So, three states of matter are solid, liquid, and gases so we are going to differentiate between solid liquid and gases on the basis of some particular character sticks the the first characteristic here is the shape so on the basis of shape we know that solids they have fixed shape liquids they do not have fixed shape also gases they do not have fixed shape next characteristic that we are going to talk about is volume on the basis of volume we can say that we can differentiate that solids they have fixed volume if we talk about liquids they have fixed volume but in the case of gases they do not have fixed volume next characteristic is rigidity and fluidity rigidity and fluidity solids they are rigid that means they are hard also if we talk about fluidity we know that solids they cannot flow but if we talk about liquids they are not rigid also liquids they can flow gases that is same they can flow and they are not rigid the fourth characteristic is intermolecular force intermolecular force that is the force of attraction between the molecules so in the case of solids intermolecular forces they are maximum because particles they are tightly packed with each other in the case of liquids they are intermolecular forces are less than solids and in the case of gases the intermolecular forces are very less then we have intermolecular spaces that is the space between the molecules molecular spaces in the case of solids we know that particles are tightly packed so the intermolecular space is very less in the case of liquids the intermolecular space is more than solids and in the case of gases the intermolecular space is maximum that is more than solids and liquids and the last characteristic is compressibility compressibility so we know that v in the case of solids the compressibility is negligible and in the case of liquids it is there we can compress liquids so they are compressible and in the case of gases we know that gases they are highly compressible 
so these are the differences between solid liquid and gases on the basis of different characteristics thank you